hey guys it's the consistent queen back again with another video i mean as you guys know we are consistent if you're new here thank you for stopping by please don't forget to hit that subscribe button trust me you're gonna love it here and if you're a returning subscriber then thank you so so much for coming back so as you guys could tell from the title of this video today we have my affordable morning shower routine so this is the routine that i follow pretty much every day except for on the days when i feel like splurging and i feel like really really spoiling myself so first things first dental hygiene guys i brush my teeth twice a day every single day in the morning and in the evening dental hygiene is so so important i cannot stress it enough it is equally important to clean your tongue so i do think that everybody should invest in a tongue cleaner this is the one that i use it retails for less than 100 rand and it's so so helpful there's literally no reason to be walking around with a dirty tongue that is so disgusting and i'm being so serious and of course the regular digglers already know i love scented candles so so much like they just help with the ambiance they make everything feel luxurious so i like my scented candle as often as i can it makes the bathroom smell like a garden and if you're a hairy girl like me you already know what time it is like for me waxing is kind of like unrealistic especially on my face because i am quite hairy and my hair does grow quite quickly so this is how it was looking after like two days as you guys can see i already have a shape going on but there's a lot of hairs at the bottom and at the top and this is after plucking i do think that um i like the look after plucking because it just makes everything look more neat and of course before getting into the shower i put on a mask so this is actually a cleanser but i like to use it as a mask and it really treats my skin so so well so i wet my face a little bit and then i apply it and i make sure i'm very generous and i massage it really really nicely into my skin and one thing about me when it comes to a shower i need my shower to be extremely hot i love hot showers like it just makes me feel so so good so i make sure that the water is literally the warmest that i can handle i actually cleanse twice so the first layer that i use is of pure soap please look at how nicely it lathers it feels so so good it feels so so soapy i mean duh <laughs> and i really just like how clean it makes my skin feel so i literally clean all over my body making sure that i get my arms and i clean underneath my armpits please don't forget to clean your armpits and um as you guys can see i'm using a loofah i try to change my loofahs at least once a month because loofahs actually do carry a lot of bacteria and it's not advisable to use the same loofah for too long I then go in with this body wash from sorbet guys this body wash smells so so good and i love how well it lathers as you guys will see shortly the lathering of the body wash is different to the lathering of the pure soap but they're both equally luxurious and guys with this fragrance it actually mixes well with my other perfumes so one thing about me i will layer a perfume so this kind of counts as the first layer because it just smells really really good guys like if there was a spray for this scent i would literally buy the spray i love it so so much
I then exfoliate my body using this body scrub and guys another thing so this range has kiwi it has collagen and it has a whole lot of good stuff and if you guys know kiwi has a lot of vitamin c in it so it really makes your skin glow and this is how the texture of the scrub is it's also very moisturizing because it does have quite a bit of oil so it makes sure that after your shower you're not left feeling very dry and now it's time for me to wash off the mask so depending on how i'm feeling it's either i'll wash off the mask in the sink or i'll do it in the shower on the days when i'm in a hurry i usually just wash off the mask in the shower Then on my face, I do the same thing. So I go in with a layer of pure soap. The one thing about pure soap is that it is such a versatile queen, hey? You can use it on your body. You can use it on your face, like literally everywhere. And this is me trying to take a thumbnail. I'm not quite sure if I'm going to use it, but um, yeah, that's what I was posing for. And then for my girl down there, my Nuni, I use this wash so it treats me quite well it's not harsh at all and i haven't had any problems with it and um this is what i use if i need to like shave my legs or shave my arms but um on this specific day i didn't actually shave i was just showing you guys what i use and i try to make sure that i always have a clean razor with me so i buy my razors in bulk they have like three four five of them in a package so i usually go for those so that i can change it as frequently as i need to and guys i'm so in love with this serum this vitamin c serum is the girl that it thinks it is like if you follow me on twitter you already know you already know and i make sure i apply my skincare product on a fairly damp face so i don't wait for my skin to be super dry or anything like that i can use it directly after getting out of the shower And also, this is just to stress the importance of sunscreen. This is not my full skincare routine or anything like that. But guys, please don't forget to put on sunscreen. This is the sunscreen that I like using. And so far, so good. And also, cleaning your ears. Super, super important. You should clean your ears every single day. And I'm being so serious. And when it comes to my moisturizer, I use this moisturizer from Sorbet as well. So basically, I just bought the entire range. Like I bought the skincare scrub, I bought the shower gel, I bought the moisturizer. Also because like it really works well with layering your fragrances as I had mentioned before. And this is how the texture feels. It's very rich, very thick. Love it. I am a firm believer in panty liners. I don't use them every day, but um, on the days that I do, these are the ones that I use. They're super thin and I use unscented ones because I also don't want to upset my girl down there. These ones, 10 out of 10, totally recommend. I wasn't going anywhere on this particular day. So as you guys can see, I just have a simple outfit on full outfit from cotton on don't play with it and this was my scent of the day guys black opium 10 out of 10 too good and lately i've been falling in love with this dark and lovely waterless cleanser so i usually don't do braids because i'm a flaky girl one thing about my hair it will flake but using this waterless cleanser has really helped me a lot and i don't really have that problem anymore and of course after doing my edges and all of that, I put on some lipstick just because I'm not going anywhere. It doesn't mean that I need to look plain, okay? <laughs> That's it from me and my morning shower routine. I hope that you enjoyed. Until next time, bye!